This film was made in the Savo National Park during the four years from 1970 to 1974 when little or no rain fell anywhere, creating what was thought to be a major catastrophe at the time. However, droughts are a common place in Africa. Through natural selection, over thousands of years, these harsh times have taken out the weak and sick animals, leaving the survivors better able to withstand conditions such as these. For many kinds of animals, this river in the north of the park is as much a lifeline today as it was during those stressful years. The Tiva, for most of the time, is a river of sand. Although the Tiva may not look much like a river now, it flows all the year round. When the bed dries out after the rains, the water still flows under the sand. In a few isolated places, pools appear. As the surface water disappears, these pools become lifelines for large and small animals. The spurwing plover has laid her first egg. Now, her problems have only just begun. You have to hand it to the plovers. They're not impressed by mere size. While dogs frequently patrol the riverbed, they themselves seldom drink and they're more interested in the animals who come to quench their thirst. A Gerenuk. She's hiding from the dogs. The dogs tear the victims to pieces in minutes. That could have been the Gerenuk. She's even lowered her ears. None of them notice the Gerenuk as they head for the puppies back in the riverbed. This Gerenuk, through keeping still in the face of terrible danger, has saved her life. In their regular patrols along the Tiva, the dogs find the two old buffalo. They've died together, right by the water where they'd come to drink each day. The water is almost out of reach now for the smaller elephants. Desperate to reach the water, the calves keep on knocking sand into the holes. <coughs> then, one morning, there is a strange silence in the riverbed. Every single elephant has left the area. This will have serious repercussions for the other animals. For all its power right now, the water will only last a few weeks, but the underground river will flow again, and that's what is important to all the animals of this dry area of Savo.